I think the polling surveying and the American public's views on TechLash indicate that it's a, it's a pretty broad range of problems. The 10 you see on the, on the wall behind you are not something that a PBS of the internet is gonna have a fighting chance of really solving for more than a few of them. It is gonna take multiple specific solutions and a PBS for the internet might solve a few of them. But to answer your question, Lee, what laws should change right away? Look at two of the problems up there. The privacy, which is number one, and the issue on political interference. Those are two areas where we want federal legislation that creates a national standard for privacy to give us all uniform expectations and consumer remedies when it comes to privacy. That's the answer to that. With political ads, we absolutely need to have full disclosure of who is buying political issue ads, and we ought not allow foreigners to be purchasing those ads without a high degree of discretion on who they are and, and identifying that, that kind of transparency. Uh, you asked what firms should do. Well, let me stay on political ads. I don't think firms should wait around for the law. They needed to start disclosing who's buying the ads for political purposes right now. Facebook's already doing an awfully good job of that, and I think that YouTube is following suit. You asked about uh, other things firms can do, and I think when it comes to moderating content, take a look at some of the issues up there with respect to bullying and hate speech. That is an area where companies in, in my group, the companies in our industry that allow people to speak to each other on platforms and social media need to do a better job of intercepting hate speech and bullying rather than waiting for it to be reported after the fact.